Hello! In this video, we're trying to work on um, a little bit more vertical flexion. I, <laughs> I couldn't always see if her nose was vertical or not, so I have a friend who's filming <laughs> and I was trying to get him to tell me when her nose was vertical and he would say it like two seconds after she did it, so <laughs> I couldn't really use that as a release time. Um, but I tried to just kind of give her a box to work in and then ideally give her breaks. As I was working on this, I felt her shoulder running out like it is here. And I was trying to figure out, like... My thought is that her shoulder running out while I'm working on vertical flexion is okay at this stage. And then eventually I'll start applying the outside leg at a position one or the outside rein to keep her shoulder in a more appropriate place or I'll work on position two a little bit better so she's bending around my leg so her shoulder doesn't go to the outside. I admit we've been working on position one a lot and so she might be yielding to the leg thinking that I'm almost like turning. Um, but anyway, love your opinion on that. Um, I'm trying to like bumper and not just like grab and hold. I'm not sure if it's accept successful. I remember what you said last time that I was working on vertical flexion when, and when she really wasn't giving very well laterally. So I was trying to make sure that I had lateral give in both directions with the bit on the ground and in the saddle before asking for anything vertical. If she felt good, if she looked rough, then that's good to know. Um, but she definitely felt really good. Felt good, I guess, except for the shoulder going to the outside. That doesn't have the best feeling in the world. But um, as far as giving to the bit, she didn't feel really hard. Um, she got confused sometimes, but she never gaps her mouth or anything like that. This is a Myler um, ported snaffle that has um, a little bit of leverage to it, weirdly. Um, it's a little bit more complicated than I wanted, but it's the only bit I had that seemed to fit her. Uh, I think my old one actually pinched her a little bit. I might try to get a more simple snaffle as well. I didn't intend to ask her to stop, but she stops pretty suddenly sometimes, and I have a hard time with it. I didn't work on this very much at a walk, because um, I was thinking about what you're saying as far as the trot is really a better working pace. I'm not really trying to ask her to yield over. Um, well, I guess I was, because I... As I was feeling her shoulder run out, I would sometimes check, like, can you bend to the inside and yield over? Can you bend to the inside? Can you yield over? And I would do them separate, and then at the trot, I would try to combine them um, so that she understood more of what the question was. Hopefully it worked. She definitely didn't seem, like, frustrated, which is good. Um, I'm just not sure I was being very, as clear as I could be. I could have asked for more bend, and then I could have seen her face a little bit better. And also, leg like, position two wasn't working very well, so <laughs> when I ask for more bend, she makes a smaller and smaller circle. Um, and I don't want to, like, make this a lot of pressure or a negative position. <laughs> so I was just trying to balance everything, and my cameraman got a little bit lost. I'm hoping to ride her in a better posture more often because I don't want to run into the situation of riding a horse with her head high and like having her develop muscles upside down.
I know it's a little boring, but I was hoping to show, like, this is kind of us working through it. Uh, we didn't do much more than what is filmed. Um, there was a, really wasn't even much of a warm-up. I was supposed to warm her up and get her okay for my boyfriend to ride because he's newer and he's never ridden her before. And she just came out of the box today, like, really pleasant and responding to everything and not feeling buddy sour or anything like that. And I was like, okay, well, I guess we'll work on a little bit of vertical flexion. Work on some stuff that we usually don't get to work on. But, thank you.